fellow crafters and fellow coupon lovers, it's the Florida Crafter, and I'm here to share with you my Walgreens haul for today. I'm going to go across and show you the items that I got, and I did a total of nine transactions. That's the first one, second one, third, fourth, and fifth one, sorry about that, six. Seven, eight, and this is my ninth transaction. So I'm sure everyone really, everyone already knows about the deals and how everything goes, but I'm just going to try to give you a breakdown as to what I did. And if I confuse you, please just leave me a comment or PM me, and I'll try to go back over it and um, let you know what I did. And hold on, let me just reach over and grab this real quick. So on the first transaction, when I walked in the store, I didn't have any register reward, so I started out with a $10 bill. And as you know, the ultimate floor is $10. And then I used this $3 printable coupon that was online. And what I got with that also for started out, uh, from got this from Greg that do, was a box of the garbage bags, which this week are... are $2.99 with an in-store ad, which is right there. And then on top of that, after the in-store ad, excuse me, there's a dollar coupon right here in the new Walgreens monthly savings book, the March savings, saving book. And it's here on page 19. Now, this coupon is not coming off automatically. So what the cashier had to do was she had to manually take it off. And the way she did that, well, she just took a dollar, took a dollar off of the two ninety nine. So on this transaction, what I paid out of pocket was ten twenty two, and I received back a ten dollar register reward. Then on over to this transaction, I used used the glass as a filler, and I got the on the go, which was eight dollars, and the Burt's Bees, which was two. I used the ten dollar register reward from the previous transaction, and on this transaction, I paid. 53 cents out of pocket now for each transaction I'm using the register rewards on the previous transaction and as we all know you can't use the register reward uh, on the same item in order to obtain another register reward okay so now going on over here to transit transition transaction three on this one I got another wine glass as a filler and I got the eternal blue which was $10, and I used the two register rewards from the previous transaction, and for this one, I paid $0.54 cents and received another $10 register reward. And then on this transaction, I got another Ultimate Floor. got the Glade Impressions. Now, with the Glade Impressions, I didn't have the printable $1.50 coupon, but that was okay because, when again, when I used this $3 coupon for the Ultimate Floor, I had they gave me three dollars in credit and the glade was three forty nine and once I used the ten dollar register reward from the previous transaction I paid seventy six cents out of pocket for this and I got back another ten dollar register reward and a dollar fifty register reward for the glade. Onto this transaction got another eternal blue and a burnt speed. Used the ten dollar register reward from the previous transaction and what I paid use it previous ten dollar and a dollar fifty coupon register reward from the previous transaction and paid forty nine cents out of pocket and then got back a two dollar register reward and a ten dollar register reward okay and then going on back over here sorry about that to the next transaction I got the glade the ultimate floor and the poly grip use the register reward from the previous transaction paid seventy five cent out of pocket Got back a ten dollar, a dollar fifty, and a two dollar register reward for that transaction. Came down here, same thing. You the on the go, the burst beads, and use the Valentine can as a filler, which this one was only ten cents. Being the Valentine filler, use a ten dollar coupon from the previous transaction, received back an eight dollar register reward for the on the go, two dollar register reward for the burst bead. Then over to this transaction, I got two boxes of the garbage bags, which as I told you, they were $2.99 with the in-store ad, and then there was a dollar coupon in the monthly savings book to come off, and then I also got an eternal blue and a Valentine candy as a filler, 
and on this one I paid 88 cents and got back a ten dollar a ten dollar register reward for the eternal blue then down on this transaction what I did again is I flipped the eternal blue register reward and got the ultimate flora I got a melatonin and then as I was getting ready to leave I saw that the chic hydrogel was on sale two for five and when you bought two you got a dollar register reward back so what I did on this transaction is I had again the three dollar coupon for the ultimate flora I had two pillies um, from CVS from the chic hydrogels from CVS so I used those two coupons on this and then I added in the melatonin and let's see and with this transaction I paid two dollars and thirty eight cents and I received back a ten dollar register reward for the melatonin ten dollar register reward for the ultimate flora four dollar register reward for the melatonin and a dollar register reward for the chic hydrogel now I haven't added it up to see what all I see how much I paid, but I do know it was not ten dollars. So as I said, I started out in the beginning with ten dollars, and then when it was all said and done at the end of the day, I still walked away with fifteen dollars. Hold on just a second. Oops. I still walked away with fifteen dollars in register rewards. Again, I hope that wasn't too jumbled up. And again, if you have any questions, please don't hesitate to leave me a comment or send me a PM um, message. And I'll try to go over anything or answer any questions that you have for me. As always, thanks for stopping by and have a blessed day. Bye.